It looks like anything and everything could change in the love and hip hop universe. And it looks like Erica Mena's comments against Spice that got her terminated. Let's get into it. So let's get into the situation at hand. It's given anti-black. Erica Mena gets dragged online for calling Spice a blue monkey on Love and Hip Hop Atlanta. And the fans, <laughs> the amount of protests and everything, they was putting heat on um, Mona Scott. They were calling on everybody. Shoot, even Rich had to chime in. Everybody was chiming in and giving their opinion on what they felt. But the fans spoke and they wanted her gone. So what's the situation? Let's get into this. So Erica Mena is catching heat online for her racial slur meltdown on the latest episode of Love and Hip Hop Atlanta. Now, during the episode, okay, <laughs> during the episode, there was an explosive episode on August 29th. The mother, model, and actress called her former friend turned enemy Spice a blue monkey after she got into a heated argument with the Jamaican dance hall superstar artist over lunch. It did not go good. The incident popped off when Mena asked Spice if she received voice notes from her ex-husband Safari, alleging she was upset about the way her former hubby showed Spice support during her near-fatal hospitalization from a illness in October of 2022. When the go down them, artist asked Mena if she had a problem with her baby daddy, warm embrace during her darkest hour. The mother of three said she wasn't upset, but the model admitted that her former lover reaction stung a bit considering that she almost lost her life during the birth of her son, legend Samuel, in 2021. Mena claimed that the Jamaican rapper showed little to no support during her risky delivery. When I told Safari what was going on with you, his reaction was, oh my gosh, I wouldn't know what would happen to me if something happens to Spice. And I said, well, damn, I was your wife, pregnant, almost lost my life and our baby. In a really dark time, I was in the hospital, which the whole world saw. So what it is, is that Erica is jealous. Erica is really jealous that Safari has more care and gave two Fs about Spice more than he did about her. That's what it boils down to. This is a this is Erica's lashing out at Spice. It's nothing more than Erica being jealous that Spice is more respected and loved in Safari's heart than she is. Now, Spice wasn't trying to hear it, okay? Because during the intense clapback, the dance hall queen told Erica Mena that it wasn't fair for her to compare their tough life events. The Grammy-nominated star also called the Latina celeb out on her victim mentality ways that she got. The problem is, Erica, I feel like you're acting like you're the first woman to be divorced. And you're the first woman that left with two kids to fend for themselves. I've been doing it for 14 years. Welcome to the club. That's when the conversation went <laughs> totally left. Meta claimed that she has been raising all three of her children independently for over 16 years. In addition to baby legend, the former video vixen shares her daughter, Safai M Majesty with Safari. She also is a mom of her eldest son, King, who is from a previous relationship. The fiery confrontation burst into flames when Spice claimed Mena's eldest son didn't even like her. In response, Mena angry flipped the table over on the Jamaican mu musician and star Spice and wished death upon the mother of two. That bitch should have died, she screamed. This is what Erica is screaming. That bitch should have died, she screamed. Spice fired back, your son hates your bitch. To which Mena racially responded, you monkey, you blue effing monkey, you blue effing blue monkey. 
She also shot a monkey ooh, 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 at the singer as she was escorted out the restaurant. Now, as a Latin woman, Mena should have known that that hard truth was way was used to do dehumanize black people for so long during the american slave trade we weren't thought of as human but as subhuman as animals that could be sold off manipulated and controlled we were considered less than monkeys you know barely you know trainable to do certain tasks mm, mm, mm. so men knew damn well what she was saying when the slur came spewing out her mouth and many black users on X, now there's Twitter, of course, <laughs> you know, chimed in and gave their opinion. After Tuesday's episode of Love and Hip Hop Atlanta Air, angry people flooded the app to call out the reality star. Black viewers slammed Erica Mena, calling her disgusting and a racist for weaponizing the word monkey towards Spice. One user couldn't believe that the mother of three, who has three half black children, could do that to call Spice a monkey on a show that airs in a predominantly black with a predominantly black audience. <sighs> People were going in. These type of women want to marry black men, want to dress like us, want to talk like us, want to be around us, want children that look like us, but in the, their hearts think we're below them. Erica Mena is a prime example of that. Erica Mena is hurling racial slurs at a black woman in front of cameras. She fully aware, she's fully aware are rolling with the intent to ear the footage to a predominantly black audience is the perfect example of exercising privilege because you know there won't be no consequences. Well, huh, consequences came, okay? Another person wrote, Erica Mena calling Spice and Monkey is disgusting and anyone that's trying to excuse it needs help. Erica showed how she really feel about black people. Okay, hashtag love and hip hop. So people were hashtagging love and hip hop in all of the posts that they were doing. Let me just see if I can show y'all. We're gonna stop sharing right here for a second because that's what's coming up too. Let me just see, let me just see. <laughs> Okay, so if you can see right here, um, it's like, like this is what was going on. Okay, people were posting like, look, Erica Mena isn't black. Okay, colorism is exercised within the same ethnicity, group or race. Calling Spice a monkey is pure and cut dry textbook racism. So people, she ain't even invited, don't she? So people were going in in these comments, okay? Let me just see what else is going on up in here, okay? Fan page for Love and Hip Hop Atlanta. I'm a huge fan. I'm not affiliated with it. Okay, let me just see what else is going on here. So here it is. Erica has been fired from Love and Hip Hop. Okay. No, seriously, where is Erica Mena's older son? This isn't the only season he has been brought on. Okay. So people were talking that. People were talking that, but people also mentioned that this is not Erica Mena's first time doing this. This is her second time doing this because she did this to Johnny Blaze. Yeah, so she made some nasty racial comments to Johnny Blaze. But at the time, there wasn't enough protest to get her removed. But um, when it comes to Spice, Spice is beloved. And she's an icon, an up-and-coming icon in Jamaica and the Car in the Caribbean. She has a huge, huge audience in America and as far as the other I and, and all the islands. So the backlash was huge this time, and people were writing into Love and Hip Hop Atlanta to get her get spot or get um Erica removed. So they wanted her ass gone. All right, they wanted her gone. They wanted her gone. Hey, schoolboy, look at the schoolboy. <laughs> I see schoolboy up in here. <laughs> Something really not right with that girl. <laughs> How are you going to go from, uh, I let my friends, in, I don't know, I'm not going to read this, but the whole point is, yeah, Erica done played herself. Okay, so now let's get into, back into, <sighs> child, child, child. So let's get, get back into this, Okay. So what is going on? What's this outcome of this situation when it comes to her? Well, 
They have posted it up on the Love and Hip Hop um, Instagram. Effectively, immediately, Erica Mena is fired from Love and Hip Hop after racist slur to co-star Spice. Erica was fired from the Love and Hip Hop franchise effective immediately after facing severe backlash over using a racial slur on her co-host Spice. An official statement was shared on the Love and Hip Hop Instagram and Twitter account announcing Erica's departure from the show. The Love and Hip Hop franchise has never shied away from hard conversations in our community. Working hand in hand without partners, viewers will see the impact of Erica Bennett's remarks play out in the final three episodes of the season. Effective immediately, she will not appear in the next season of Love and Hip Hop Atlanta. <laughs> Fans of the VH1 reality TV show were up in arms over Erica's comments during a sit down at a restaurant between her and Spice. Spice had claimed that Erica's son doesn't like her, which led to the argument quickly escalating. In a shocking moment, Erica flipped the table and called Spice a monkey. So Erica will no longer be on that show. The origin of the conflict between the two women appeared to revolve around Erica's divorce from Safari Samuel. She was upset that Spice had posed for a photo with her ex-husband and his rumored new girlfriend. However, Spice claimed that she had taught the safari to discuss his issues with paying child support to Erica, and he revealed that Erica had been saying unpleasant things about Spice to him. Oh, boy. Sp oh, safari, you're messing up blood clot. <laughs> oh, safari, you was a messy dude. Mm, mm, mm. Jamaican men can be messy, y'all. <laughs> the meeting with Shekana. Oh, gosh. Yeah, I'm so sick and tired of Shekana. Shekana is always around when there's some problem or conflict. Messy why? I see why Tiny and Tip got rid of Shekana away from, an, uh, away from them. I see why they got rid of her. Because she's always in some mess. You would, like, she kind of is one of them messy ass aunties that always be alone and they got no gosh damn man. Yeah, I said it. The meeting with Shekana was supposed to help the women settle their differences, but took an ugly turn when Spice accused Erica of being a narcissist and focusing more on sympathy for her divorce than on more serious issues. This led to Spice making a comment about Erica's son not liking her. The use of the racial slur on the national television is deeply troubling, and it perpetuates hurtful stereotypes and dehumanizing an entire face. Viewers who voiced their opinions on social media were appalled by Erica's language and did not accept her distress as an excuse for using the slur. Some even pointed out the privilege she displayed in using such terms seemingly without a fear of consequences. Erica has yet to release a statement. So y'all, I want y'all to comment below and tell me what y'all think. Like, what can she say? <laughs> what can she possibly say to make us feel better about that? Hmm. Like, seriously, what can she say to make us feel better? Because honestly, she cried. She needs to make a public apology because I don't think she want her beautiful daughter, her son, to see this years later of her calling people a monkey, knowing for what her kids are half black. Erica, you gotta do better, this girl. This ain't your first time doing this. So y'all, what y'all think? I know her kids gonna be embarrassed when they see that years later when they grow up. <sighs> Erica, you gotta grow up, child. You gotta apologize. And I think, honestly, you need to get some therapy because you got a lot of internal hate and a lot of internal um, anger and, you know, and stuff that you need to deal with. You girl, you need to heal. And y'all comment below and tell me what y'all think. Does she need to heal? Does she need some therapy? Was she wrong? Was she right? What y'all think? I know Spice made that comment like, yeah, your kid don't even like you. Nah, nah, nah. But real talk, all these years Erica been on show on TV, them kids, her, her oldest kid ain't never really been on nothing except for one or two appearances and that's it. And, but her babies, them new ones, they've been on every, they've been on a lot, a few episodes. So what's up? Y'all, y'all tell me something. On that note, I, it's your girl, Pop Culture Goddess. Y'all, if y'all comment below and hit me up, 
hit that like button and subscribe if you haven't already. And on that note, your girl's out. Bye. <laughs> this is crazy. Thank you.